Jason, what's up, man? What's up, what's up, what's up? We just sat in on your signing. Mm -hmm. Family was here, man. I know a lot of emotions going through your head right yeah, now. Yeah. Um, how does it feel, man, to to really go to the next level and, and do this in front of all your people? Um, you know, I just feel crazy, you know, just sitting here and just looking at all the work you done put in and be here today. It's like really, like real crazy, all the doubts you had and like you didn't think you were going to be here. It's right. crazy to be here right now. It's unbelievable. Yeah. Did it make all the work worth it? Yeah, yeah. Make it all, yeah, it definitely made it all worth it, you know. Just want to keep going now. Okay, okay. Now I know you're from originally from Salisbury, right? Yeah, Salisbury. Yeah. And what school was you attending high school? Um, Y. Y High. Yeah. Okay. How many years were you there? Um, three. Three. three yeah. So okay, that's interesting. Like, mm -hmm. so tell me a little bit about the switch mm -hmm. from from coming to, from a public league, mm -hmm. Y High basketball, mm -hmm. to coming to Cross in a Christian league, mm -hmm. and kind of traveling a little bit. How? Um, was, what? Tell me a little bit about the switch. You know, it was definitely crazy, but then I was used to crazy stuff. You know, COVID happened, shut down school for a long time. So I was like, okay, it's whatever. So I came here, just, just no, I went to Delmar Christian first because I had to be class. So I okay, okay. Christian. Was that your sophomore year? Yeah, sophomore year. All right. No, that was my junior year. Junior year. How long were you there? Um, a year, just a year. Okay, I was okay. I BIA for a while. So I came here, and, you know, it was just crazy, you know, coming from playing teams like down the street and going traveling all, all around and all that other stuff. You know, it was Definitely crazy, but it was definitely fun. That's what I always wanted to do. For yeah. Traveling. So tell me a little bit about the different level of competition. Yeah, it was definitely a big jump. You know, he was playing people that was, um, I mean, that was coming up like real, real tough people, like real guards and real like big men, all that stuff. You know, mm -hmm. people taller than us. Like everybody we played against was almost taller than us. We had six, six foot and up. So like, yeah, it was definitely different. People dunking all the other crazy stuff. Yeah. Trying to get dunked on. You know, you really had to play defense. It's, right. It's not, right. But um. On the base side, defense wasn't that big of a thing. It was just like, wasn't big. But on here, you gotta like play defense and really get back and really know the game to mm -hmm. succeed over here. So, yeah. Did it feel faster? Yeah, definitely faster. Yeah. Okay. How do you think that switch from what wherever you came from directly to here? How do you think it grew you as a basketball player? Um, definitely made me work harder. You know. Look at different aspects of my game and show them that I had to like grow. You know, me shooting, for me shooting, me dribbling, all that other stuff. Maybe definitely had to grow because back then I used to get way with eat stuff like that. Right. You know, coming here and playing, getting different top level, I had to like definitely grow as a player, and my knowledge of the game definitely had to grow. So all yeah, that was, yeah, great stuff. I'm sure. Uh, your favorite game this year could be a game that you just liked or a game that you killed or whatever. My favorite game this year. It's crazy. It was Moravian and prep. More heavy yeah. and Where are they out of? Uh, they was in North Carolina? South Carolina? North Carolina? What was it? North Carolina. North Carolina. Yeah, we got busted, but you know, it was definitely a great game. You know, Cosmos was around. Okay. It was a, definitely a great experience. Even though we lost, I definitely seen a different level up there and then what we really had to do. Get your perspective. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. This is where I'm at. Yeah. Yeah, okay, okay. Um, now, was that also the toughest team or you got a different one for toughest team? You that was the toughest year. team. Bunch of that was the toughest? Yeah, they was, yeah, definitely the toughest. They were okay. shooting, shooting out the gate. Did you know any players on there? Like, nah, definitely. Okay. I was thinking like YouTube links, you know, oh, highlights yeah, go around. Yeah, YouTube. Yeah, I seen one of them on YouTube. Okay. So, yeah, it was like. I can only imagine. Yeah, that's crazy. So, what about player? Who was the toughest guy? Are you like, man, he, he a little different. I don't, I don't even know. I never really had that. I mean, they all had a different aspect of the game that I'd never seen before. So it was like everybody was seeing people who was like, oh, that's crazy. I ain't, I ain't never seen that before. Did you have more of like a, like a defensive role on cross? Um, yeah, defensive role, talking role. Like I was just, I was a, I was a person that helped them like on the court. Like I was just like the talk of the person. Yeah, and leader. Came to me, yeah, and, if, and, if, and needed something that came to me on the court. I was just like, there to help. Okay, like, okay. Just, 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 okay. So let's move to what we kind of just got done doing. Your signing, um, going to Bridgeport, yes, in Connecticut, right? Okay, okay. So, what are you can give me three, three goals for yourself that you have set out or plan to set out for Bridgeport in the next four years? Um, they um, three goals. Let me see. To grow more as a guard, I want to go there and grow more as a guard. Definitely grow more as a guard. And, um, I want to get more guard knowledge going there okay. too. So I want to be more like guard smart and um. Third plan, just just to help win, you know, stay mm -hmm. locked in, help win, don't get distracted up there. That's what's up. That's what's up. So I hear that you're gonna be doing a lot of guard skill yeah, work when you get there. Yeah. Big, 
Okay, okay. That's what's up, man. Um, and lastly, before we close, what is your advice to newcomers and old teammates that you're kind of leaving behind here? Um, for, for newcomers, um, grades is an important part going into college. You, know, you can get money from that, too, and you can get half that scholarship. So that's mm -hmm. like more money for you to get in school. So yeah, just stay on top of your grades and always, and always stay focused. Um, upcoming, it's gonna be a long, long season. So just stay locked in, know what's coming for sure. And I like what you said about academics because I feel like that's the area where a lot of kids your age, once my age, yeah. sleep on, mm -hmm. and uh, we don't take it serious enough. And, and it's literally the epitome of what college coaches yeah. look at. So. I'm glad you said that. Being a person that just signed, people gonna see this and look up to you. They don't even know you, and you somewhere they want to be. So I'm really glad you said that. Any last words for anybody, or whether it's family, or coach, or your team, whatever. Uh, thank you for everyone who believed in. Yeah, yeah. That's what's up. That's what's up.